When you wake up with a sore, red bump next to your lip you may be wondering if it's a cold sore or a pimple. Even though these are completely different skin problems, they can start off looking very similar. However, there are clear differences between their causes and how they're treated. How do you know the difference? Let's look at the clues that can help you distinguish the two. A pimple is usually a small, firm inflamed spot on the skin and has many other names such as zit, bleb, boil, carbuncle, and others. Some pimples may become large. A pimple is an inflamed area of skin with pus formation in the center, resulting from a bacterial infection of the oil gland that produces sebum. A cold sore is an inflamed blister, also termed a fever blister or oral herpes, on the lips and or near the mouth, caused by infection with herpes simplex viruses, HSV1 and HSV2. What are causes and risk factors for pimples and cold sores? Cold sores are caused by HSV-1 and HSV-2 viruses, with the majority of facial cold sores caused by HSV-1, about 80%. Risk factors include person-to-person -person transmission by direct skin contact, sharing eating utensils and other personal items, such as razors or towels. And even kissing can transmit viruses through saliva. Pimples are caused by inflammation and bacterial overgrowth in the sebaceous glands of the skin. They are not caused by person-to-person -person contact. Risk factors include clogged sebaceous glands, whitehead and or blackhead formation that indicates clogging of sebaceous glands, hormonal changes, especially in individuals undergoing puberty, and or chemical irritants placed on the skin. Breakouts of pimples sometimes occur due to hormonal changes, for example during menstruation. What are the signs and symptoms of pimples and cold sores? The signs and symptoms of pimples and cold sores can be summarized by the five stages by which both pimples and cold sores develop. The following are the signs and symptoms of pimples, reddish, flat small area of skin, possible whitehead or blackhead development, pus develops that eventually spontaneously drains, inflammation decreases and skin heals. The following are the signs and symptoms of cold sores, fluid filled blisters begin to appear, blisters ooze clear fluid and form painful sores. Sores dry and form scabs. Scabs fall off skin and skin heals. The process for pimple formation and healing often occurs over a longer time span than the process with cold sores 2 to 4 weeks. The longer time span is due to the time it takes to form whiteheads and or blackheads. Additionally, it takes about a month after pus develops and drains for the inflammation to decrease and have the skin heal. In some individuals who have pimples with large areas of pus, the skin may form a scar. What are treatments and medications for pimples and cold sores? The treatments and medications for pimples and cold sores are different. The most common treatment for pimples is an over-the-counter medication that comes in lotions, gels, cleansers, creams, and skin washes, it is benzoyl peroxide. It can kill bacteria and also remove some of the oil and dead skin cells associated with whiteheads and blackheads. Another common treatment is salicylic acid, which helps to open pores. Individuals with severe pimple formation may require antibiotics, for example, minocycline and doxycycline, and consultation with a dermatologist. Do not pick at or pop pimples. This can make the infection worse and result in scar formation. Alternative medicine for pimples includes lemon juice, tea tree oil, green tea, honey, mint, echinacea, and many others. For alternative medicine treatments, you should discuss them with your primary care physician before use. Treatment for cold sores does not cure the disease, but it may speed up the healing process. 
there are many antiviral drugs that are used to treat cold sores. These antivirals may be administered as pills, creams, and more severe infections, even injected. Alternative medicine treatments for cold sores include lysine as an oral supplement or cream, sage plus rhubarb in a cream, propolis, synthetic beeswax, and stress reduction.